I'm Ariana. And I'm Ruby. And welcome back to So in the Know. Merry Christmas in July. We're beating the heat by pretending it's December, and the countdown is on to perfect that cookie recipe by December 24th. But in the meantime, here are some events that are happening this week. Tells 360 and Zotropolis Cinema Stillhouse are teaming up to celebrate a new independent whiskey documentary, The Water of Life's Lancaster Debut. The film is having a homecoming of sorts, as Lancaster is the current and former hometown to some key team members. Brad Kenyon, Alphonse Palema, and Greg Sports. They'll be holding the Lancaster premiere at Zotropolis on July 28th, with two more screenings on Friday, July 30th. The premiere screening will be followed with an incredible free whiskey tasting at Telus 360. The tasting will feature the groundbreaking new Irish single malt Waterford whiskey's four expressions. The Telus tasting will be capped at 45 and will begin approximately at 8 p.m., so make sure to pre-register on Eventbrite. Join architectural historian and RLPS partner emeritus Gregory Scott for a guided tour of Lancaster City's architectural treasures this Thursday at 4 p.m. The tour will explore the downtown and southern city neighborhoods, highlighting the former Conestoga Steam Mills, which now houses the School District of Lancaster offices and Carter McRae Elementary. The building is featured in Charles DeMuth's famous painting, Lancaster in the Province No. 2. Sanitized headsets will be provided to improve the audio experience. Each attendee will receive a handout outlining each building featured on the tour to take home. There is no cost to participate, but a limited number of spots are available on each tour. Go to demuth.org slash events to register. Head to Flinchbow's Orchard in New York for Peach Fest. Spend the day in the orchard and pick them straight from the tree. Their Peach Festival features pick your own peaches, photos in the sunflower fields, and you can even cut some to take home, fresh peach sundaes, and tractor-drawn wagon rides through the peach orchard. Plus, enjoy live music, activities, and every peach-inspired yummy treat under the sun. Join them at the orchard and farm with your friends and family as they celebrate the sweetness of the peach season. Admission to the Peach Festival is even free. G's concessions and Annie Ann's will also be on site. And so will we. We gotta go to that. We have to go. <laughs> Lastly, but certainly not least, the Taylor Chip Cookie Company will be celebrating the grand opening of their new Mannheim Pike location and the launch of their new coffee. This Saturday, doors open at 9 a.m. and the first 25 people in the store will score some free Taylor Chip stuff. Come meet Shelby, the manager of the Mannheim Pike location, and the Taylors. In addition to mouth-watering six-ounce cookies, Taylor Chip also offers personalized cookie cakes, edible cookie dough, as well as gluten-free and vegan options. I love Taylor Chip. I've never had it, but the website, the cookies look so they good. I really want to eat them. <laughs> Our nonprofit spotlight this week is on the Power Packs project. The Power Packs project recognizes the vital role that nutrition plays in children's ability to learn in school. Each week, a recipe for a low-cost meal and the ingredients to make it are provided, in addition to staples like peanut butter and cereal. Nearly 20,000 Lancaster children don't know where or when they'll find their next meal. In Lancaster City alone, more than 71% of the district's students qualify for free school meals under the federal guidelines. Now more than ever, volunteers have been the backbone of success to the Power Packs project, and they need your help. They're seeking volunteers for the warehouse, school distribution, and administrative support. They love hosting groups and will tailor projects to the size and abilities of your group and the needs of their organization at that time. As of now, they have openings for evenings and weekend group projects starting in August 2021 and beyond. Visit their website for more information on how you can get involved. Back to school is right around the corner. As always, thank you all so much for tuning in to this week's episode of So in the Know. If you have an event you'd like us to share, shoot us a message on Facebook and make sure to stay connected with us on social media at So Good Lancaster. We look forward to keeping you so, so in the, the know. know. And Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas in July. Christmas in July. <laughs> so in the Know is brought to you by The Candy Factory, a co-working and social club in Lancaster, PA. Find out more at coworkinginlancaster.com.